Uh, my name is Thad Griffin. Today I'll be showing you different abdominal exercises other than your regular sit-up and crunches. Alright, the first exercise is going to be suitcase crunches. This works your mid to upper part of your abdominal. First thing you want to do is you want to keep your hands a little bit wider than your shoulders so you have a good base. You want to keep your feet straight out in front of you and feet together. Now you want to bring your knees to your chest while keeping your feet off the ground. This works your mid to upper part of your abdominal and extend out, just like that. All right, for our next exercise, we're gonna do lateral V-ups. This exercise works your side obliques on both sides of your core, of your abdomen. In this exercise, you wanna lay on one side and you wanna take your knee, I mean your elbow to your knee pulling it up into the air with your right or left leg, depending on which side you're on. This works and you want to hold it for about five to 10 seconds. And after you did that, you want to flip over to the other side and do the same thing there. Make sure you bring your elbow to your knee and you hold. This is a really good exercise for all sports. Okay. All right, our next exercise will be Russian twist. This exercise is similar to suitcase crunches. In this exercise, you want to put your hands at your chest and you want to pull your knees up to your chest with your feet off of the ground. And then you want to twist side to side, touching the floor on both sides of your body while you hold your feet off the ground. This works your obliques and your lower, this works your obliques and your lower abdomen. All right, the next four exercises really target the lower part of the abdomen. They all deal with the lower part. Our first exercise would be single leg jackknives, where you lay flat, extending your arms out over your head. In this exercise, you bring one leg up at a time, and you want to touch your toe. You want to make sure that your back is up off the ground, and you really squeeze your lower part of your abdomen. Okay, our next exercise would be um, double leg jackknife, which is the same thing as a single leg, but you bring both legs up at the same time. Remember to make sure that you keep your back up off the ground. Alright, our... Right, our next exercise is straight leg leg lifts. This is the same thing as your double leg jackknife, but you, what you're doing right here is you're putting your hands underneath your butt and this really works the lower part. And you want to bring your legs up and when you come down, you want to hold it about six inches off of the ground, not touching the ground. And you want to hold. Okay, our next exercise is toe touches. Toe touches, you want to bring your legs up and they're like this, holding at a 90 degree angle. In this exercise, you hold your arms out over your body and you go up and down, squeezing the lower part of your abdomen. You want to make sure that you keep your back up off the ground when you come up. This really targets the lower part. All right, our next exercise is bicycles. Bicycles really work the mid to upper part of your abdominal and a little bit of your obliques. In this exercise, you want to extend your legs out and straight, no, stand them out straight, and hold them about six inches off the ground. And you want to put your hands behind your head. And now, you want to bring your left leg up to your right elbow as far as you can. If you can touch it, that's great. And then hold and let go and switch, which would be bring your right leg to your left elbow and hold. You want to hold for about five to 10 seconds, depending on how in shape you are. You want to keep your back up off the floor again. Okay. All right, our next exercise is front bridge. Front bridge, you work in all of your abdominals, your lower back, and your shoulders. In this exercise, you get on, you get down the floor facing with your belly to the floor and laying kind of like you're in a push up position. And you, once you bring up, you hold with your shoulders and you want to stay your butt flat. down. This really works your lower back and your shoulders. 
Okay, our next exercise would be side bridge. It's the same thing, but you're on your side using one arm. And you want to pick it up, and you want to hold flat, like this, putting your arm at your hip. This stabilizes you. This really works your side oblique and your left shoulder. All right, switch. And it's the same thing on the right side. Working your right shoulder and your right oblique and your right half of your abdomen. These exercises strengthen your abdominals, which are the core of your body. Athletes are the main people who really benefit from these exercises, but so do everyday people. It helps to maintain a healthy lifestyle. Thank you. Bye.